ready to go when you are, look. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. We're having a culmination exercise, which brings all the individual pieces of training that we've been doing over the last few months into one exercise and puts them together in an operational picture that shows the capabilities of their new C-145. In the demonstration, we were displaying basically what we have been able to achieve since we started our training as a crew. Uh, it is important for the U.S. and uh, the Kenyan military to work together. We are able to do more because uh, we are basically acquiring the best skills from your training and our combined exercises. It has been interesting working with your counterparts. We can learn a lot from your people and we can also better our forces. The C-145, it's a more tactical aircraft. So for me it has been different. The sharing of the knowledge, the directing has been awesome. I met new people, made new friendships, and uh, made a whole new family. Really, it's a symbiotic relationship between us. We kind of need each other. We need the Kenyan Defense Forces, right, just as much as they need us. So what we bring is the train, advise, assist mission, and we advise the Kenyan Defense on how to tactically employ sustainable operations. This is our home turf. They know it best. They show us how to take what we bring and how to use it in this environment. The C-145 uh, aircraft has uh, better capabilities, especially in augmenting some of the other equipment that we have, like the Wi-Fi, which doesn't have the short takeoff and landing, like this one, and even the airdrop, especially in the port operational areas where our troops need uh, immediate supply. Our goal is to interoperate on a global scale and strengthen our country's partnership together. <laughs> the most meaningful part is that I just made about 15 brothers since I was here, right? So they're all, they're all in Dugu to me.